Anytime you beg another man to set you free, you will never be free. Freedom is something that you have to do for yourself. Meetings and conferences. The apex of the systems was to be the Bank for International Settlements in Basel, Switzerland, a private bank owned and controlled by the world's central banks, which were themselves private corporations. Each central bank sought to dominate its government by its ability to control treasury loans, to manipulate foreign exchanges, to influence the level of economic activity in the country, and to influence cooperative politicians by subsequent economic rewards in the business world. It didn't just happen. So this all brings us to the here and now. In a book called, and this is a great one too, 62 questions, 62 answers. The title is uh, Debt, the IMF, and the World Bank by Eric Toussaint and Damien Millet. That book chronicled the use of debt, which they termed a mechanism of dominance. The use of debt to gain control over developing nations, and they predicted that that same treatment would come to us. It has. John Perkins, in New Confessions of an Economic Hitman, recounts his involvement in the same project. His job description says it all. This is his job description. Claudine, who was his, uh, his tutor, Claudine told me that there were two primary objectives of my work. First, I was to justify huge international loans that would funnel money back to Maine and other U.S. companies such as Bechtel, Halliburton, and so on, through massive engineering and construction projects. Second, I would work to bankrupt the countries that received those loans, after they had paid Maine, of course, and other American corporations who were involved. And, um, I was to do that so that those countries would be forever beholden to their creditors and would present easy targets when we needed favors such as military bases and natural res other natural resources. So that's Perkins in uh, Confessions of an Economic Hitman. What? <laughs> it's almost enough to turn a person into a conspiracy theorist. 